Hello, YouTube. Crazy Robot Lady here. Uh, I'm back, and I uh, attempted to bend the uh, prongs on my Cricut tape player door thing back uh, into place. Uh, and now I'm going to try and put the tape door back on. Now, I'm very nervous because if you look, sorry, I'm shaking. If you look at the tape door on this side and then on the other side, there are three little clips that click in at three different spots. The one, the one at the bottom is for the bottom hinge. And then the one in the middle is um, a further uh, secure thingy so that you can't flop the tape door open, which I think was a really good idea. And there's another one on the other side. And um, the one at the top of the left side of the door connects to this. And when you press the, uh, let me get this. Sorry guys, my tripod is uh, broken, um, and it's all I've got. Okay, let's move this back some. Okay, let's try again. <laughs> um, right here. If you press the eject button, you can see this little plastic bit wiggling. So that's what the top part snaps into. Uh, and so now, um, I'm going to try and put this back. It's not as simple as just snapping everything in because you have to get both of these in as well as the bottom two and the top one has to line up with the little plastic bit and I've got to figure out whether it's got to go above or below above oh great Right, so, uh, you guys will excuse me, um, if I don't speak much during this, it's just because I'm having to concentrate, because I only have one, um, and I don't want to break it by doing something stupid, or not paying attention. that one in. Come on. Goes one. Crap, 
it's too high. Okay, that one's gonna go. Come on. But it's okay. So that one's got to go first. Crap. Come on. What to go? I feel it. Now you've got to go. Come on. Come on. Uh uh. Don't you go up. You gotta go down. Come on. The other one popped out. Come on. Come on. Get in here. Stop that. Come on. Get back down in there. Oh, thank you. Buddy, do they have to click in from the bottom? Like, how does I see the clicky do on the bottom of this? And there's also a little, um, a little spring-like aperture. Okay, I'm gonna have to get my screwdriver because I can only get one of these at a time in to the second clips and I can't get it with the other side. <clears throat> I was hoping I wouldn't have to repeat the same procedure when I took it off. Oh guys. I'm so nervous. I'm like sweating here. And it is a lot of work to get this bad boy back on. You wouldn't think so. But it is. Okay. Um. I don't want to put a lot of pressure on you. All I want you to do is bend in just a little so you can go into this hole. And I can clearly see the blooming hole. Come on. Just bend and drop down. Come on.
This makes me look violent, I'm sorry. I don't mean to. Look, one or the other of you <laughs> has got to go down. You can't both possibly be too strong for me. Come on. further back, buddy. There you go. All right. Well, that's lined up. Now I gotta get the one on the other side. And down. We have to do this at the same time because I can't. I am not strong enough. Should I be putting pressure from the bottom and just jamming in the bottom two hinges? I don't like that idea <laughs> at all. these clicky-doos. But, whatever I do, it's coming in way too high. Ow. Like, it comes in, uh, See what's happening here? There's a gap. And I don't know why, and I don't want it. So 
if my third attempt or 50,000th attempt here doesn't work, I'm going to give up and wait on the Playmates Master. Come on, don't you go up. You've got to go down straight and you've got to click into this hole. You're going, you want to go. Yeah, I don't trust myself. But I know what has to go where. And I'll show you guys again. <clears throat> this top bit has to line up with Shut up. Hold on. <laughs> it's, it's hard to do this backwards. Okay. That has to, this top piece right here has to line up with that. And then this middle piece here has to click in to here on the right, on the left side and here on the right side and then the bottom two this one on the uh, left has a little niche that sticks out and it has to line up with this little, let me bring that down a little, springy-do thingy right here. So, I don't know, it's a pain in the butt, and uh, I'm not getting anywhere with this. So, um, I will, uh, leave this to Mark because uh, I don't want to break anything. Um, oh, it makes no sense to be this nervous, but uh, I, I see what I have to do, but for whatever reason, it's missed. <laughs> it's just not happening. Um, it's, it's lining up fine right there, but when you go to press things in, it's getting stuck, um, ugh. It's getting stuck where the um, click, the reinforcement hinge things go. Uh, and then I've got one more hurdle at the top where I've got to connect the um, eject release mechanism to the, uh, to the cassette door. And before I break anything, uh, I'm going to go ahead and stop because I don't want to put this metal in, or metal, wow, plastic in uh, any more stress. So, sorry we couldn't get this back on uh, here on camera, but uh, I will have her back together soon. And we can see what happens when I stick a tape in her. Hope you guys enjoyed. Sorry, uh, I'm so shiny and sweaty and stuff. I don't know. I'm just not good with actual robot repairs. I can review them all day. I can show you, like, their functions and stuff. But, uh, anything, 
anything else, anything more serious like repairs and that kind of thing, I'm not there yet. So anyway, as usual guys, thanks for watching. Uh, subs uh, like, subscribe, click the notification bell so you will know whenever I put up new content. God bless and I will see you in the next video.